So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is gonna be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Good punch, Lance. All right, here we go, early round one. We talk about wrestling being a great equalizer in MMA, but length and reach is another one. He's got a great jab. We'll see if he can employ it. Tonight. You have got to be born with it, right? You don't get taller. When you're a tall guy, you have to understand to make your skill set match your physical abilities. And this guy has done this tremendously. Looking to land the right just out of range. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Nice body to run on the elbow. Oh! Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. The right hand just misses. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Try to establish that jab. Ooh. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! Right hook to the head block. Oh, big left hook there. Fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground. Too. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. Close guard. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Albu. All right, side control now, DC. You know he's in his element on the ground. A lot of tricks up his sleeve. A lot of tricks. Albu gets up, but he looks dazed. He looks confused. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your pump. John now starting to show signs of swelling. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Outstanding knee to the there. He's the taller fighter. Might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so then. Oh, and he lands down. Using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not too distant future. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Nice. So holding on to him here, not doing a ton, perhaps just looking to recover. Well, you like the thought process to go to the counter. Ultimately, the execution not there. That's a miss. Pretty good straight punch there. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves to go. Go finish this fight. Oh, big left. Just out of range with that right hand. 
Five minutes in the books. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went head hunting, landed, nearly got the finish, too. A lot of coaches tell you don't head hunt. In this case, he's been head hunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. Are you ready? You ready? All right, round two. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Way to hide that leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Throwing that jab now again. The fighter of ace. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by Alpine. Straight right hand now, just misses. Effective punch there by Chor. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, hey. order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken. Oh! Posture unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. Oh, that's a good right hand. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, working inside his opponent's guard here. You cannot sit in these jujitsu guys' guard. And you can't have one arm in, one arm out. Guys who start throwing up legs, chasing triangles. Punch over the top. They continue to exchange. Beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Just misses with the right. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit tall. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. That's a big strike right there. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh, nice jab by Al. Like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Good kicks there by Albert. Timing the shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Albu's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Huge block there. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice one, two there. Straight punch land.
Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Gotta be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Real nice body to land. Punch coming, it's blocked. Nice punch by Albu. Single collar timeout. Two rounds in the books. Well, a lot of high level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K1 level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Big leg kick land. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Oh, man, look how quickly he gets that foot to the target. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is the opponent is not controlling his posture. He allows the opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land a beautiful ground and pound combination. Joy gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. We're trying to double up on that jab. Whoa! And just like that, the fight is over. Wow! Wow! What a fight! Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. So a huge result and a seminal moment for him here.